Mike's had a fantastic impact on the field of radiotherapy. I've had the pleasure of working with Mike for decades. We started to work together as graduate students, worked in the States together, and here at Princess Margaret. The impact that he's really well known for as well is the automation developments in collaboration with Tom Purdy. Building a platform allowed us to completely automate the process of treatment planning, taking it from hours down to minutes. This helps in two ways. It makes treatment planning more efficient, allowing us to reinvest time back in patient care, and it also makes the experience safer. These technologies allow us to do this. The patient coming in, we can design a plan the same day and get them onto treatment. We can generate many plans automatically and choose the best one for them. And with automation AI technologies, we can have expertise from around the world working for that patient, for that treatment, that day. So Ray Station and Ray Search are pioneering a system that helps with treatment planning for radiation therapy. This is a task that formerly took hours for humans to do and now increasingly is done in minutes with these new advanced technologies. The paradigm shift here is that as automation helps us with calculations, with treatment planning, there's more time to invest in safety, in patient relations, in higher order functions that really underpin the value of radiation therapists, oncologists, and those working in the radiation therapy environment. A few years ago, Mike participated in a, in a debate paper in medical physics, predicting that treatment planning would be automated in just seven years from now. And the graduates from Michener are gonna graduate into that world. They're gonna learn in that world, they're gonna practice in that world. And automation, understanding how automation is going to change the field for them and how they're going to use that automation to improve care, advance practice, and then teach others around them, I think is critical. New technologies are introduced in our hospitals every day, and this technology has now been adopted by two centers in Canada. But this is the first school. The integration of Michener Institute with UHN is exactly for this reason, to help our students get closer to the latest of technological advances. This kind of adaptive radiotherapy uh, is going to be very powerful in the future, and platforms like RayStation allow us to pursue that. This advance comes about as a product of collaboration between physicists, radiation therapists, and oncologists. It's a very proud moment to name this center in honor of a great physicist who was part of the development of this technology. Mike would be delighted uh, to see this collaboration forming between Research and Michener. The idea that we're training uh, the future of radiation therapy uh, with state-of-the-art technologies that came out of innovations in the clinic through this collaboration, this laboratory for training and education set up at Michener, I think it speaks to Mike's legacy. He'd be proud. In a highly technical area like radiation therapy, we rely on our industry partners to keep us at the cutting edge. We're very grateful to Research for helping us establish this technology at the Michener Institute of Education at UHM.